Hello out there, readers of Wiglaf and Mordred. If any of you actually read my Twitter feed, you know that I'm now running Snow Leopard, or Mac 10.6. And with it came Quick Time 10. We're in love with Quick Time 10, because as you can see, it includes screen recording, which is very cool. because you can see me do dorky things like write out what I'm saying. Anyway, I figured it would be fun to do a little drawing session, sort of like what they do on those live streaming camera things, but not live and not buggy and all that fun stuff. So instead, we're going to just test this out and see how it works. Because if it works really well and people like it, maybe we could just do a whole step-by-step -step for Whammer something of the like. But for right now, I think we're just going to draw a happy Horatio, because he's not very happy very much in the comic right now. And sadly, I'm not going to be able to entertain you very much. I think just talking is going to be about the extent of it. Oh, and look, he's got eyes, which is kind of fun. Because when drawing Wham, you'll notice most of the time I just draw the little button eyes that don't really do anything. Like that, which is not very fun. But it's a lot faster and easier to draw. So. But for right now, we can do something a little more detailed, because it's just a sketch. And this is a test run. And we'll see how long it takes me to just start mumbling incoherently. Which will probably happen very quickly. Or I'll just stop talking completely and you guys can just watch. That stuff happens. That works too. Whatever makes you happy. Or you could just turn off the volume and just watch the sketch. And of course, oh, of course nothing. See? It's already happened. Mumbling incoherently as I sketch out Horatio's little ponytail thing, which happened out of nowhere. Really. As I pretend to draw and know what I'm doing, I don't really. Here's his tie. I think I'm just really excited to play with a new toy that came with my computer. Which hopefully is obvious. There we go, I think I like that. Just something simple. Hurry, she was not a complicated person. He hasn't been around for too long, so most people don't know that. But yep, yeah. and there we have a sketch. So let's go ahead and finish it while we're here. Make a new oh, typo. Make a new outline layer. Get a size five pin because I love thick outlines. And you see as the talking stops nearly completely and you get to listen to awkward silence. Nope, didn't like that. Didn't like that. It's the best part of doing digital art. Because I can keep doing it over until I'm completely happy. I can't remember the last time I drew with a pen and paper. The lack of undo feature has undone me. Haha. <laughs> Undo. Undone. I am a dork. Yes. Lily admits it. She is a dork. Always has been, always will be. A 
I noticed none of you were disagreeing with that statement. Probably shaking your head, going, we knew that. Either way, this is fun. Especially since I actually have to keep drawing straight. Because had this been any other time, I would have been distracted by about 50 different things by now. But now I'm on a timer, and people are watching this, so I can't distract them by doing 50 million other things in between drawing. So what would probably take me at least twice as long. So, see that audience? You're forcing me to be productive. Production. And if you're really paying attention, you'll notice all the people I'm ignoring. Just to talk to all of you. That's right. See? I am messages. Being ignored as we speak. And there we go. Completed outline. Not my best, but just something quick. And because I'll forget if I don't do it later. Sign. Ground up there. Let's go ahead and color this. Gonna pick a background color. That's good. Oh, I forgot his eyebrows. We can go back. Just add something simple. Now we can color. You notice I grabbed my colors from his character palette. Yes, the profile images have a double purpose. Because you'll notice over here where I store colors. That little color area I just circled are actually these ring colors. Because they are very hard to see right there. So I blew them up. Very handy tactic. It's always good to have a color palette so you can keep uniform colors. Except for the inside of the mouth where I don't think I've ever picked the same color really twice. It's a bad habit. It makes them interesting, I think. 